Trend View is an awesome way to view what's going on inside your PLC system in real time. For example, here we have a rung that takes analog input WX0, compares it to 2500. If it's greater than 2500, it sets output coil Y0. We can try that here in our simulator. As I increase the value of WX0, you can see the rung light up and coil Y0 turns on both here and here in the simulator. Viewing the status is nice, but it sure would be great if we could see what that analog value was doing. Well, that's where Trend View comes into play. To view in Trend View, we just right click on the rung and say Trend That Instruction. I'm going to move my simulator out of the way here so we can see what's going on. The white trace is the analog value, the red trace is at 2500 constant, and if I just change my analog value, you can see it bounce all over the screen, and as it crosses the threshold, Y0 is turning on and off. Now that was trending just the instruction. Let's go back to our program. And this time I want to see both the instruction and the output coil. Well, to do that, I say right click, monitor values from run contacts and coils to trend view. Now the trend view has a split window. Analog values are here, digital values are here, but the result is the same. If I play with my analog value, whenever it crosses that red line, sure enough, I see Y0 in this lower window go active. Now if you wait long enough, things will scroll off to the left end of the screen. What do you do then? Well, if you hit this history button, you get a scroll bar and it allows you to scroll back through your entire trend. Once you've done that, on the time scale, you can simply crank that up and go take a really, really close look at exactly what your PLC system is doing. You can record the trend view, and you can also export it so you can view it in another program, like a spreadsheet. The Options button lets you change the trace order, the trace colors, which allows you to fully customize the entire trend view. Here's another example. We have a rotating claw, and we want to know how long it takes to get from one position to the next. Over here, you can see I have all the stages of the program code block outlined in the data view. All I have to do is right-click, Trend All, and here's my trend plot for that code block. If I activate the wrist rotation, and I can see how long it takes for this move to complete. As you can see, TrendView is an incredibly powerful yet easy and intuitive way to view just about anything you could want to monitor on your PLC. Inputs, outputs, stage bits, control bits, anything can be viewed in TrendView. Be sure to check out the other videos in this series for more ways to get up and running quickly on the Do More PLC. And as always, send us any comments or suggestions you may have on these videos. We appreciate the feedback. Spend less, do more from Automation Direct.